And we are live. Hello, lovely. Hello, Thank beautiful you so humans. much for coming. Don't forget your thummies. I'm going to say that right off the bat. They do matter. Al so, and yes. Lennox like Today them. we have um, two different replay uh, giveaways. Because we for, forgot last week yes. because of all the mayhem. So, yeah. So, we have two of those to announce. Um, we're going to have so talk about some t show and tell type stuff and then extra tickets for this replay give mm -hmm. like so come back and respond yes we got some extra tickets we'll talk about that more it's as we get along coming back and responding yes just so, saying thank you all so much for being yeah. here um hopefully we stay clear this time Oof. Craziness. And um, yeah, another thing we're going to talk about is the auction, which is not. I on the made a little bit of a, on Dee's live last week. I, I said, oh yeah, right. It would be the 11th, the same as her uh, 4K celebration. But no, I was I misspoke. I apologize. It's going to be the following week on the 17th or 18th, whatever that Saturday is. I think it's the 18th. So that's the uh, Mental Health and Meows annual because we're only going to do it once a year auction so be mindful of that now i'll we'll, we'll yeah, let we'll you know talk about that time. more yeah. we'll drop community tabs and all yeah, of that absolutely. and whatnot you'll hear more you'll be you'll hear plenty you about will it hear about it absolutely what is that maria says rusty you're not actually in your living room you're currently driving to pennsylvania oh i oh. am <laughs> Jeez, we're not sorry. Live. This is a premiere. It's a premiere. It's a recording. Unbelievable. I'm we sure we'll stay so real crispy sorry. this time. <laughs> That's why it's clear and we're not worried about it. Uh, because I, it's, a, it's a recording. So we're actually in the chat with you. Because time quietly. is not real. Time is not real, Which man. is why that's also the name of our big channel. But our, time, like our, the spice, yeah. and real, like a movie reel. Yes. But yeah, so, yeah. So um, that, that was it. That was, I love I hope the we things some of we you. come up with right before we start <laughs> doing anything. Like, oh, we got this. Let's. Yeah. This is what we're gonna plan out. We don't plan out all the big things. We plan out that one moment where I'm gonna lean in and read the non. And of course, Marie is gonna make a comment, comment so it falls. Because Marie perfectly. would be the one that's like, hey, Rusty, you know, <laughs> aren't you're not you going in the to Pennsylvania? Room, right? Like you're. Yeah. Driving. Absolutely. And like I always say, Pig destroyer. Oh, I forgot what I always say. I was going to put on my Pig Destroyer shirt, but I didn't feel like changing my shirt. Isn't that the cutest shirt? The little Morton Salt. It's from It's Always Sunny. Doesn't it look like Rusty on there? Scale the snail. Scale the snail, but it could it could be Rusty. I'm a soul the world for snail? her. Any hoot. Yes. Now that you all, all right. know we're in video mode, we're, we're in the probably chat right now. being hilarious in the chat. <laughs> 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 yeah, trying our best to keep yeah. up. Yeah, bunch I, of crickets in I the will chat. say, um, we're not going to do the game... Uh, we were trying yes. to figure out how to do the game with the tickets. I didn't have all the things yeah. ready by now. So you have to obviously, right now it's Wednesday. Wednesday we're filming it. It's our yes. time. Wednesday is our time right now that we're in. Not not our time. Right. It's our time. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. We're, we're in saying. our time, we're in the chat. Yes. Conversing with you. So it moment. would be too difficult to try to give the tickets away yeah. in the chat and like announce when. So we're just going to wait and save that and we'll do that. And that's why one of the reasons why we're giving extra tickets in the replay giveaway. Yes. So, so yes. We'll let you know how that works in a little while. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, so what do you want to do first? Um, I would like to, because we were talking about the auction. Yes. Something I haven't been doing as much as I used to. I've been all I on seen shirts, these. on notebooks. I did. There's nothing on them yet. On oh. shirts, on notebooks, and whatnot. I've been doing all that, but nothing I used to, see to here, put. Folks. I used to do like vinyl crafts oh. on like the nice hanging woods and um, like canvases and whatnot. So I'm going to make at Those least really two, pretty. if not hopefully more, of these with vinyl on them. For the auction, um, it's Those not just nice. go, we're we're gonna obviously do bigger things because we only have yeah, a short period of time. Couple things. So this will be doing. something we add, like each one will be added into a box of yarn or something. Yeah, because we're trying to make the 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 auction items larger, fewer larger items. We know time we, is very limited. We're limited for only remember that two four hour one two, we did. Uh, oh my god, no, no, never again. Oh. And two hours, yes. and then we have to have it all done. So. So yeah, I'm gonna make those, and I was gonna make one about Yarnalicious and whatnot, and I was like, Mama G, what other 
thoughts? What other uh, yeah. sayings should I put down? Which that's one of the things. If you would like to drop yeah, that, in drop the that in the comments right now. Talking about um, some other a good s saying. Yeah. Don't just write the saying. Like put a little bit more words to it. But talk about one of the sayings if you'd like in the comments. That might give you an extra. Oh wait, you're talking chance. about the comments in the replay. Mm -hmm. In the replay, well, right? They oh yeah, because yeah. Oh, they can the, comment right now. now. But in the replay comments, talk about some of your favorite quotes. That might be something Yo, that gets wink, you wink. an extra ticket. Hint, uh, hint for Queen of Tea. Yes. Uh, anywho, this one over here is like, why don't you do yarn is for hookers? You should do it like Virginia is for lovers. And I'm like, I love that, but Virginia is too long of a word and it doesn't, it didn't sit right no matter how so I it, did it. Have it resemble the Virginia is so for I'm lovers. I'm not done with this yet. This is my first like real attempt at doing almost my like full own design, but I'm going to have that. It's a skank of, hand, uh, it's skank of yarn. A skank of yarn. <laughs> sit on part of it and then have yarn next to it so it's long enough to still yeah. kind of resemble that. So, yeah. It's but a I was skank very, of yarn. I'm very excited, especially about how, like, oh, I did it so quick. It just happened to me. How I, I still have to do the yarn in the face. Ola Joy's, o Ola Joe's going to want this one because she's going to kick out of the skank yeah. of yarn. <laughs> I might make two almost identical, if yeah. not identical, because this is going to be funny. I think, that's, I think that's adorable. Yeah. So. That's what one of my and you can even put in the bottom of it. Brought to you by Skank of Yarn. <laughs> oh, that should be one of our sign offs. Yeah. So yeah, that's in that, fact that's I've been be making fun. lots of skanks of yarn at the time of this video this morning. If I could just interject, um, you did so you can. Yeah, I'm going to because I have I'm older. I could do that. I can do but, that thing uh, where I get off. Yeah. So uh, two days ago, I spent the entire day. I I um, dyed. 21 hanks of yarn with some new c cool ideas that I came up with. I didn't see them anywhere. I just kind of did them in my own head. Not that they haven't been done elsewhere, but in my own head, I tried some stuff. And um, so I, tr I was so excited about that two days ago. So this morning when I got up, I said, well, you know, I showed, I did a video showing all those hanks. So definitely check that video out. It'll be coming up after you see this. So that's going to be all the really pretty skank, skanks of yarn. It's going to happen all the time now. I'm going to say skank instead yeah, of hank. It's one of those things. So just go you with it. You make one wrong turn. Just deal with your it. Your first time going yeah. somewhere and you question yourself every, every time. Every single time. Turn. So it's going to happen. So, nice. uh, so then this morning I got up because the technique that I was using in the last video that I did yesterday, in the last uh, dyeing process I did yesterday, I said, let me reproduce that and try to make a purple shade. Well, I purple. spent all day... Uh, with just six hanks and uh, miserable, absolute failure. Uh, total. If you want to ever hear my voice, very disappointed. It's in that video. So this it's a little bit longer of a video, but it shows the whole process of it and how I, it got messed up in my attempt to try to fix it. So that video will be coming up. So <laughs> I didn't know any of that. Sorry, it was such a tough time. Oh, it was horrible. And then then my vape broke, and then my phone died. Then. You know, but hey, if you don't have the bad days, you don't appreciate the good days as much. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So that's that's where I think about that. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, I will say real quick. She got black tape on her arm. Kinetic tape. Kinetic tape. Now, what is kinetic tape? It's like, it just Besides the fact that it's about kinetic motion. to you. It no, that would be connected tape. If you get, uh, this is the cheaper one, just because I was seeing if it was going to help with my elbow. I, as you know, have been practicing roller skating. I've talked about it a lot. You've um, been practicing hitting the floor. Well, I practiced the learning just because I was able to spin a decade, decades ago. Doesn't mean I can now. And I tried a move that I definitely shouldn't have, and I, I fell. But because it wasn't a move I should have done, I didn't even know or remember how to fall properly because how to fall properly is a very big part of doing anything yeah. on anything in fast motion. Um, so yeah, so I was testing the kinetic tape out, but I'm sure somebody said because I was doing the hand thing. So if anyone has asked in the comments or and it, it's helping want to her. know about it, what's nice is it takes the relief off of this joint and the muscles here by placing them on up here. So that's so you have that's, more muscles that's doing like the, the job of what would have been. Yeah, no, here. that's yeah. good. It's relaxing that one that's sore by utilizing the other and muscles around it. And I think you should it. test this out and use something like this when you're crocheting and whatnot. I'm going to try helps. that yeah. when I'm crocheting. If I, mean, I if I did it for my body, I would need a whole body suit. Full wrap. 
toe wrap. Mumby. The mum, mum, mumby. What do you call those things? Mummy. Mummy. No, I put a And it, it comes in strips. I didn't cut these, so I could literally give you two or four strips oh. to test out. Yeah. Great. Cool. No, I, I would try wants... it because I, I would like to put it on my shoulder and my elbow because that's the, the part. Of I just recommend if you are going to use these, don't just willy nilly take them on yourself. Go online and look up what. Like, I looked up the fact that you know, it was my elbow, specifically how to do that, and learned where I was supposed to start them and where you're supposed to end them and how you put them around. Yeah, because you want so to that use they're the properly muscles. properly doing yeah. it. When if you just don't know what... If I just wrapped it around my arm like a band, it wouldn't have done anything other than probably cut off my circulation, but... Yeah. Yeah, so if you do Well, then your them hand them right. would get no blood, so your hand would start hurting and throbbing in the pain. So I'd have to tape that Mentally, up. you would be just not feeling taping. this pain because that pain would be worse. And I would just keep taping the whole arm. It's not, not, it's not how you do it. No. Not a doctor. No, not a doctor. Yes. Any hooch. Can um, I show my glasses? Yes. Oh, yeah, let's do the glasses. All right, uh, I brought these last week, but of course, as you know, if you were here. And honestly, anybody new from last week that stayed, all of you, we appreciate the oh, all oh, OGs yeah. that stayed with yeah. us. Our true but support. some new people stayed with us yeah. through that whole debacle. And thank you. We thank appreciate you, you so understanding. Much. That it's we're still working on it. We're choice. not going to go into yeah. it. We're just saying we're still working Moving on past it. it for now. All right, so these are glasses. They, they came with this little oh, yes, cleaner. And I seen these on another uh, yarn. My, I have a dye in my fingernails, so just deal with it. Um, from another content creator or, or, yeah, whatever, yarn person. And I thought they were cool as heck, so I bought them. And... They're really interesting looking. What is wrong? You should sew them from the side. And then... Please. Okay, so I'm going to let you look. Now, see... You can see the names. You When you, you're looking forward, yet it's showing you beneath you. And okay. they want to try to find your name on the list? There's mirrors. Yeah, your list is way down here. And it's showing you that. So my thoughts were two things. Well, three things. I thought they were really cool looking. So that's how it's working. So number one, why I wanted them, they were really cool looking. Number two was they were a certain amount of money went down to ten dollars, so they were on sale. Of number Craig's three, version of crocheting. yeah, three version. I'm trying to figure out where if because trying to do uh, tutorials and you have your camera to have that view is in your view of seeing what you're doing, and I haven't figured out the proper way to do that yet. I'm hoping that if I use these enough to crochet, I can have my head forward instead of slouch down, and then have my camera here, and I can like look over the camera and, video, and, and crochet for tutorials. I'm gonna try that, but I, it, if that I, doesn't work, I can lay in bed completely flat on my back, put these on and watch TV. Can I, I say something just for no. me wearing them and testing that? Yeah. Um, don't wear them because you all know that that's what we do. Yeah. Um, normally we respect boundaries unless we're oh, being we're, we're being totally sad and sarcastic our videos or you know in life. Yeah, if mostly. you haven't figured out that we're very sarcastic, have you even seen us? Yeah. Um, the one thing I can see you doing is trying to lean forward to have it be more magnetized. So I would recommend. Let's just say you were sitting at a desk at a lower table. I'd recommend trying to have your workspace be about actually a little higher up. Oh, because we're live, so you guys can come. We can, uh, yeah, make yes, some that's comments. A great comment about. Oh that. my gosh, yes, Barb Jarby. Spot on. I um, love that comment. <laughs> it might. And Marie work, always comes up with the best. whether or not you're sitting or standing, Hi, Dory. having a taller desk, so your workspace is up here instead of here. Yeah. Because if your workspace is here, well, I do have that that thing that I could. If I'm sitting in bed and crocheting, I have even test I out that. taking a little piece of paper and writing with those on with your workspace up oh, here. Oh, that's to a see, good idea. Because I think that that's the only thing I can see you doing is sitting weird to adjust. Because that's what I felt like I wanted to do. My hands All right, are here. Yeah, I'll, I'll I wanted to get closer when I'm doing it. So yeah, upper workspace. Yes, and upper also thank you all for coming. Blanket hello to everybody. Obviously, hello to the lurkers yeah. and. God bless you to the replay uh, uh, watchers. Yes. Okay. Just saying. Just We always forget to throw that out there, and we need to acknowledge all the wonderful human beings out there. The many lurkers. Petey might even be out there. We don't know. Petey might be lurking. Petey might be Petey, lurking. Petey, if you're lurking. We don't know. 
We do love you and we miss you and want you to come visit. And if you visit, bring all your stuff because we're not letting you go. <laughs> Just saying. All right. So what do you want to do next? We didn't really plan plan. I mean, do you well, want can to I, can I show, show the stuff? Well, can I show? You were talking about the auction. Oh, yeah. Right. Let's finish with so auction let's, stuff. Let's go back to the auction stuff. All right. So the auction's coming up May 18th or whatever that Saturday is. Um, I don't know if that's the Saturday. Let me check. Just check because I'm going to... You know me in numbers. All right, so I started making this blanket a couple days ago, and it's an unconventional blanket because why not? And I found some really cool yarns. Why are you pointing? I'm oh, you're saying yes. I thought I saw a finger. Yes. Um, and I, I actually tied the, what the brand is of yarn on there. So, and this is going to come with it. All right. And I happen to have had... Four of the Caron, um, what are they? Spice cakes. I had four of these. These are all acrylic, but they feel like wool. They're thick. It was like a five or six weight. Six weight. All right. So I had four of those. And then I also had this little um, Cascade yarn. This might have come from uh, Aberdeen. I'm not sure. So I had this with the blue glitter. And that's, this is the colorway of the Cascade. Um, and then I also added some of the faux fur. So like I said, I'm, I'm putting pieces of the yarn so I know what yarn is in what section. So I've already depleted three of the, well, I'm in this, on the third cake. This is going to be a super heavy blanket. It's going to be a, a very warm blanket. And it's just a granny square, but... I'm going to show you the other yarn. Um, all right, hold that for me. But it's connected, so things are dropping. So there, there's this fuzzy jar, y okay. yarn. And then I had gotten a few of these from um, Aaron at Crafting Kitty. It's a beautiful uh, halo, very soft. So I've got three, four of those. And then Dory, Dory Dunn did it again had given me some of the worsted uh, eight from Hirschner's, and this is like a nice purple, which matches. So I grabbed yarns that matched. Um, this and, matches your... Yes, my life. Yeah, yeah, and also what's around your neck, but yes. My, our, pride, our life. Uh, my pride glitter one broke. I, I, I'm so upset. I don't remember who gave me this. I have it? apologize. No, it's broken. I it, you, it, Did you throw it out? I buried it in a casket in the backyard. Oh. Um... This cloud cake, I don't remember who gave me this to me at the moment. I'm sorry. But this is super, super soft. So that's in there and whatever. So these are the yarns that are in the project. All right. Let me just throw this stuff in there. I'm show, well, she can hold the project up. This is what's so far manifesting from all those Ooh. yarns. I haven't seen this yet. No, I just, I just started this. So I'm, I'm doubling holes, up so on some it. of Ooh. them. And then... Here is, you could see the glitter. That is that a little bit Ooh, harder my face. yarn. <laughs> oh, I missed your face. I would have smacked you. Yeah, you're but, like, so this sorry. granny square, I'm going to keep going until I can't go no more. All right? And I doubled up here. And then there's a, a, this is that thick furry stuff. So all the colors coordinate, and I'm mixing colors with it. And I don't know how big this is going to be. I could tell you it's going to be heavy. It's going to be warm. I think it's really, really pretty. But then here, there's fur in with that other blue yarn. And I had to play yarn chicken with a couple rows. And I won. I made it work. So I had to rip some stuff out. But this, anyway, I don't know how big the blanket will be. And it's this certainly gorgeous. It's certainly not going to be one of the, as good of the blankets that Bod's getting for her uh, uh, animal um, uh, auction. But this will be available on at the auction. And I'll give you all the other stuff. But the most important part about it is there's nothing wool in here. So, Jeannie, if you're listening, there's no wool in this one. All right, so this is going to be for everybody. All I right? like the, the use of, this is a great way to use up, oh, I only have one exactly. skein left or one. Yeah, so it's kind of like a very organized, scrappy blanket, but it's not scrappy because I use brand new rolls, uh, skeins of uh, all the yarns. But, yeah, so that's going to be available. This is gorgeous. Let me just see right here. Did I make a boo-boo? All right, I see that I got a loop that I missed here. I will tack that in. I just want to make that in my head. 
Because it's hard when you're doing two, uh, holding two together, sometimes they get away from you. And she's playing peekaboo like she did when she was a little girl. And she looks like she did when she was a little girl. Very scary. Did I ever tell you that when she was born, she had black eyes? And, I, and they handed her to me. I was like, oh, my God, what did I like do? Like doll's eyes. Yeah, no, it was creepy. <laughs> yeah, like Chucky. All right, give me my blanket. But anyway, that's going to be one of the things that's going to be in the auction. Also, I've been dyeing a lot of yarn. Ooh, many of the, on this side. Many of the yarns are Let's going see. for the uh, Halloween advent. But I will have some yarns. Uh, that I'm dying available for the auction. So I will also be showing you the colors in, like that video that I told you. Is that better? I filmed it this morning before I started to dye the yarn. I filmed it this morning showing you all the yarns. So do check out that video and watch it. Um, we could use some watch hours and we could I'm just saying I'm going to try. I'm going to try to dye yarn. Oh yeah. Uh, I'm going to try to dye yarn. We'll be filming that. That'll be filmed but I'm going to try. That'll be, be being filmed. Oh, yeah. I just want to get this in the bag because we're by the dogs. I'm I like to, to um, keep it away from the dogs. But anyway, um, yeah. So if you do have anything that you wanted to donate um, to the auction, again, not sounding like snobs in any sense of the term. We just have two hours. That's we have two hours, and right we're now. only doing this once a year now. So we need to raise as much funds as possible because we're only going to do it we in May make, during that's why Kitten season. The first and the second auction that we did, we had so many small items, and we appreciate them and love oh, them, were, but that yeah. that's a lot of time to take up for a small thing, so yeah. we're either going to be... But that and that get, auction took four hours. I can't yeah. do that again. So even like I showed what I'm going to make, I, if we had a bunch of time and all the spoons, I would love to auction that off separately. If somebody would like to... Yeah. If you see an item that's in one of the grouping packages that we make that you want just that, reach out to us. We can maybe recreate, recreate it. it. Yeah. But I'm going to bundle that with yarn and make a custom Other tote stuff. and yeah. all that so it's so that there will be substantial items which of course are going to go for more money hopefully anyway. Um, but also too I just I just recently uh, bagged up some yarns that I had my stash and yeah, they're not the greatest, maybe. I didn't get into the bougier stuff yet because I was just getting out the first batch. But there again, there's something. You can go back to that video. I still have some of those available. So, yeah. you know, if you want some Red Heart, and there's, I got five skeins of Red Heart and and, uh, and shipping. I got I to gotta charge shipping. I don't get that money. It goes to whomever collects that money. But um, yeah, you could, if you don't have a lot of money and you want to help support, you could buy a bag of that yarn. You got yarn. Well, a, speaking of that, um, just so I don't, I'm trying real hard to not forget my thoughts. Go so, ahead, I'm done. Um, if one were doing the auction, and especially any of the items I have that I'm making that I'm auctioning off, I could recreate those pretty close, if not exactly. Like I might not have the exact same glitter iron-on like vinyl to put, or I might not have yeah. the same base of a bag, but. Um, so if you want to reach out about any of those, do, because I, I know not everybody has the ability to right. buy a bigger exactly. ticket item. And if we get through all of them, I'm going to I'm gonna have some stuff I have for the Halloween Advent ready. So let's just say it's going great, we get through them in a timely manner, yeah. and we get to a point where we've gotten through the big ticket items, I'm going to have smaller oh, ticket some, items. My, 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 my yeah. one skein of sock yarns, I'll we'll do have that. some yeah, smaller okay. ticket items that... If we have the time Thumbs up to, if you agree. we'll get to it. So we have a bunch of these wonderful conversations and these ones where we're clearly live and I'm not driving to Harrisburg and... I know, I'm not going to be driving room. over Harrisburg. Um, but we most of the lives we get to have I a lot of invited. nice like conversations. But if in this one, if we can keep this auction going, we might be able to make it where we can get through the bigger stuff and then get to smaller stuff for people that might not be able to have as much. Yeah. But we will offer those I'm if we don't totally get to that. that. So yeah. you're just trying to make it as yeah. like we and us as we possibly can. Oh, also can. too, uh, during this premiere that we clearly are not live. Not live. Any I'm not wearing super the shirt right now. And, well, not in now that you're watching. I mean, I am, but I'm not now. Well, you might wash and wear it again. Who knows? Or do you have other plans, unquote? But any super chats, super stickers, gifted memberships, all of those, even though right now we can't see it, those are all going to get entries into the um, monthly giveaway. 
And uh, we thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, because we do appreciate so much. Um, I know everybody's on and ha has hard times, and money's tight, and we do appreciate that you guys uh, take a little bit and and share with us because it does help us with shipping and stuff. And and I just wanted to point out, I'm not complaining uh, at all, but um, like when I dye yarn, um, I'm paying. The same money you pay for that skein of yarn, only I'm buying it undyed. And then yeah, I'm going through the process and putting the dye and doing that. I don't have a wholesale account um, because we're not a 501 3KD ABCD FBI. So, um, and anyway, so we don't make as much money as we would if we had a wholesale account with all these uh, places. So it costs us a little bit more out of pocket. So I, I, I try to keep the prices of our yarns equal to everybody else's. But um, I don't even know why I'm saying that. But I also am running out of yarn. So I got to wait a little bit before I could do another big purchase. But anyway. So anyway, let's show what's in the um, appreciation. appreciation. All right. So we did do a members only video which showed these items but we thought we would show it to all of you so and this one's the members this is the members, okay, the members only one. i did add a little bit to it that you didn't see if you watched the video but also too if you didn't see the video at all you get to see it all and if you are not a member and you really want to try to win this and want to be a member for a month you have an opportunity well actually no because anybody who's a member now goes into next month remember <coughs> so it will be something simple. <coughs> yeah Attention, I use dogs will be for a second. Yeah, sorry for the barking, but there are house and dogs. All right, so maybe I'm gonna have you just, just balance that for me. All right, um, I'm gonna give. I'm gonna. At one point, I did have two of these so people could make a sum bunny, but somebody said, "What are we gonna do with two? So I was like, "Okay, don't want to make a sum bunny." So there's gonna be. Four that I'm adding into the members only. This is the one that a lot of people like. I forgot the number. It's not on here. But um, I, I prefer the darker one. I, I mean, I, I love this one, but I prefer the darker one. So I'm also including that. You guys did not see that in the original video. Also that you didn't see in the original video, I was gifted this amazing little uh, ball of yarn, cake of yarn from uh, Jackie at uh, Crochet DHD, and I used one in the farmer jeans that I'm uh, upscaling, which you haven't seen that video yet, but I thought I would share this with you guys. It's a darn good yarn, or a good darn yarn, and really pretty. Oh, that's cool. The colors. I'm surprised I'm giving it away, but yeah, I, like that. I have yeah. so much, and this kind of goes with the jive of that. And then, oh, and this is my friend Jane. She does... Uh, uh, resin, all kinds of resin things, and she gave me a couple of cats, so I'm throwing that I'm in sure there. That and this, things. yeah, this is just a little small. This one doesn't fall out. It's a uh, darn good yarn with the little buttons, so there's that in there. It's being loaded. Oh, okay. So we decided instead of it being so yarny, which we did throw some yarn in that you didn't know if you did watch that video, but here is a artist starter kit. You've got all your color pencils. Um, you also get, these are shading sticks, and that's your sharpener for your shading sticks. You get two different types of erasers. This one's my favorite because it turns into like, it's almost like silly putty. And then a pencil sharpener, and then underneath here uh, is a bunch of crepas of all different colors. Mm -hmm. And then a little pad, you know, with just some paper, but... I'm sure you get a nice. I didn't get a nicer pad, so you apologize for that. But what the heck, get your own. All right, and then since you got coloring pencils, mm -hmm. we're giving you. This is from Hershner's, and it's really cool. Dragons, and we did in the members only. We said, hey, would you want us to color these before you got them? And a lot of people were like, yeah. Yeah, like if we each like, color picked them. one or two, like either we do one together or Maybe we, we could just do one together. Yeah, yeah like we could just do one, one together. together and we'll sign it. So if you are the recipient of this prize next week, 
immediately let us know if you want us to color a picture and in your do folder. recognize that that means you will have to wait slightly longer to Is have it yeah. mailed to you because we will need to color it color it yeah <laughs> that takes time and then this is the um, acrylic kit and you also get some cray paws here another eraser this is an actually a good eraser a little pen a pin whatever that is called a palette Ugh. and then some acrylics and a pencil and a brush it's just a nice little starter kit actually here is there's everything that's needed that's even a better view all right so we thought let's because we're venturing into other things besides just yarn mm -hmm. and we're creating we're getting back to our roots and, and when i say we we're talking to you constantly changing the crafts we do so we yeah sometimes it, like a lot of y'all do the diamond painting and other things it's it's nice to venture into other other crafts so or as my husband would say other crafts oh my god i called her my husband that's it demerits demerits all right so that is uh for oops sorry members Did, only that's a members only bag yes and, and we got a lot of members and we appreciate it and again we we pick I, I know i keep saying this but i want this to be abundantly clear so there's no confusion is the very the first day of each month we pick and i write down all the members mm -hmm. at that moment because your membership lasts for a month yes so the that month is those that month's recipients anybody that gets a membership will go to the following month, first mm -hmm. of the month, for that month's, month's membership. I hope that that's clear because I know we get confusing. Yes. We confuse people. All right, so this is, um, of course, these bags aren't as big giveaways as some, some, of the folks some content creators I won't mention, but the best we can do. All right, summer's coming with daffodils and sunshine. sunshine. So here is some cotton and... Um, it's premier cotton. It is 131 yards or 120 meters. Okay, which way? And I'm looking for the, it's a four weight, though I'm going to say it's a skinny, skinny, four, it's four on a diet, okay? But there's enough to actually make a wearable, sort of, maybe, allegedly. All right, this Ice Ice Baby, yes, I have four skeins of ice, and they're purple, and I'm giving them away. Um, it's a nice color match. Yeah, it's pretty. It's, I think it's saying it's a three weight. There's a little bit of fuzz. Now these, I do believe, have wool in them. Let me just check. I don't know. I don't want to open the bag because it's sealed. It says 100% acrylic. Oh, never mind. No wool. I lied. They're 100% acrylic. Okay. And oh, the yardage or meters. There's uh, blah, 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 blah. Uh, 120 meters, so there's more than that in yards. So mm -hmm. there's four. So you, you, it's a, you can make something out of that. And then there's six ices. Same like I have in the other one, but here's six. So you get that. And then the the only th I only had two left, so I figured oh, this month you get them. Do you want the two big? Yeah, and then we did offer the other package of this in the l other giveaway. And, uh, yeah, this is really pretty. This is a Mandela, 590 yards per cake. It's, again, 100% acrylic. I'm saying that, but I'm not seeing that, so I'm hoping that I'm correct. Um, the colorway is Phoenix. It's a three-weight. You are correct. Is it 100% mm -hmm. acrylic? All right, pretty blues and uh, mauves and um, like a... that. It's a nice bright red. Okay, that's in there. And then the last, oh no, not the last, there's more. And a furls hook. Oh, if I can open it. I hate keep reopening the furls hooks because then they, the, the top sounds bad and it feels bad. All right, this is a six. This should work well with the smaller yarns. It, can you see the blue in the, it's blue. Oh, nice. It's a really yeah. dark, beautiful blue. That's a furls hook. Okay. Almost looks iridescent blue. All right, so that that should help you crochet. You want to grab one to show. Yeah, this is Queensland collection. It's called Walkabout. It's organic Shelton wool, Shetland, Shet, Shetland wool. 
I was the only wool product. Yeah, just walk with, about. Right? Yeah, walk about. There's, well, actually, you can show the other color. Um, they have 157 yards or 144 meters. It's a two weight. It is Shetland wool, so this is a little bit on the rough side. Are I'm you? Wondering. You wouldn't. It's yeah, it doesn't bother yeah, me. Yeah, it's really not that. But sorry that I rubbed my my DNA on there. Um, <laughs> get a little bit of. But I got Mama yeah. G. You get a little Mama G. Yeah, you could put this somewhere and have a crime and then have me in trouble. Um, <laughs> the colorways are just numbers. Oh, Glacier, I lied. And then there's a colorway on that one. It's yeah, a, it, but it thought. is 100% wool. This colorway is aubergine. Aubergine. All right. Oh, that's that purple, I think, that all you all are talking about. It's a nice purple. I should know these things. I'm no freaking artist on my life. But anyway, so these here, what I'll do is I will bag the wool. If you win this, I will bag the wool separate. If you would like the wool to pass it to somebody else, or if you would prefer not to have the wool in there, I will replace it with an acrylic or a cotton or something else. So what, if you do win this, you let me know. Now these prizes... Oh, let's look at, think about the wool. The physical prizes go to the lower 48 states. If you live outside the lower 48 and you want to help pay for the shipping, we can work on that, or you can get a monetary PayPal or something like that. Craig is in the house, just saying. Craig we're excited. Is in the house. He's home from work and we're videotaping. Sorry, Craig. You look good. You, you got, you're more filled in here, it seems. Or maybe it's the hat and glasses, the whole vibe. Just You look new more... Hat. You have two, it's, it's the, the hat. new hat. It's, the new, it's hat. the new hat, then I think it is. It's the new hat. Yeah, no, it's a good look for you. Very uh, lumberjack, and I don't care. You got to go to a tattoo convention next time. Oh, that's right. Oh, I want to hear all about that when we get off the off of here. So anyway, a lot so of people are tattoo convention and boots. Yeah, a lot that, of tattooing. Uh, I wasn't there though. I wasn't invited. Just saying. I guess the second time I said that in here because there's two <laughs> things, two things that you guys are doing that I just wasn't invited. But I am invited to Mars's uh, May fifth. Mars is having uh, a concert in Elmira, New York. Mm -hmm. Um, there is a way to watch it live. I will try to figure it out. Uh, I, mean, it, I mean, you have to buy a live ticket, but yeah, you pay from for your it. home. You, you can, can watch buy it. a ticket to watch it, live. and you're supporting him. Yes, and he sent me a a, a a video to watch of somebody singing, and it was a big performer. And I I don't get it. I don't know why, but I'm wondering if that's somebody else been somebody that's going to be in the show. I mean, it's Mars. But then Mars There's just sends many me. reasons he could. But usually send he sends something out. that's like, you know, I would understand. He just sent. He just sent it. Just, there was no definite. Maybe by accident. I don't know. But um, I'm. I'm. I thought maybe for a second that maybe that person that he sent. But it's a bigger. You know, they have a lot of followers and a bigger group. And I'm wondering if that's one of the people that are also playing in the in the in the concert. Possible. So that might be what he was doing. Give me kind of a. Hey, this is what else is what you're going to see. So I'm excited to do that. Uh, Rusty and I are going as staff members. So we will be in charge of uh, any. Press. I'll bring my sewing. We're technically pressed. Oh, we're, we're going to go. Oh, we're going to have press I'm pads? pretty sure we're pressed. All right, so I'll bring my camera so I look like I'm pressed. Mm -hmm. And um, I'll also bring my needle and thread sewing emergency kit in case a, I, uh, one of his costumes mm -hmm. uh, rips or something. Because you never know. Always never be prepared. Hence why I'm called Mama G, because I always think of those things before anything, and I always bring the needed Very items necessary. just in case of an emergency. That's why I got my name. All right. All right, let's call the winners. Yes, let's do some You winners. hold that. You can show that. I'll get the random number generator. So up. because, just so everybody understands, because we had to do two separate lives on two separate occasions now to see if it would get better service, what we did is anybody that commented, because that's what it is, if you comment on a replay, if you commented on this one and this one, you got both. If you commented on just one, you get right. just one. But yeah, everybody. Did you explain that clearly? Because we, we, because we had a part one. The last two weeks of lives, we had to break it and do two. So to be fair, anybody who commented on both, you get two entries. All right. So 
because each one I'm sure is she said appreciation. Exactly that. I wasn't yeah. paying attention. Was appreciation. So that's what we yeah. do this for. Our, thank you for coming back and commenting. Yeah. So yeah. you get four. And these will be, you get five yes. entries. 39. If your name is called, you get five entries. And that's five entries into winning the a monthly appreciation prize. All right, how many do we have on there? 39. 39. Number 39. All right, so we got one through thirty-nine. Yeah, hold that up. I I know it's really sloppy because I literally just jotted it this all down. It is not sloppy at all. I will show right. you sloppy. Are we ready? Hold your breath. Congratulations. Good luck, everybody. And the number is. The number is twenty-one. Twenty-one. Number twenty-one is Moonlight Tracy. Woo -woo. Tracy, you won. All right, so Tracy, you don't have to email anything or anything. I'm just going to make five entries and put you in to the um, next week's appreciation. Yeah, we're, we're calling yeah, it next week. So definitely, next week. all y'all, if you're still here, hopefully, uh, definitely be here next week. Mm -hmm. All right, next mm -hmm. one. You have to change the number. Hold on one second. Oh, I got a minus I got, one. I got a commercial. You did a math thing on me. It's 38. 38. I probably could have figured that out. Oh, no. All right, so I have one through 38 on here now. Just go ahead. Go ahead. And are you seeing your name? I hope. I hope you guys are all right in the chat. Oh, let's try hitting the button. Your number is. And the number is 19. And the 19. number 19 person, Carla Gordon. All right, Carla Gordon, you get your blown out. Yeah, it's really, I don't know why it's, it wasn't it's a because second of ago. lights and paper and white. All right, so, oh, let me, so I don't forget. Um, let me circle, what was it, 21? Moonlight. Tracy gets circled here. You get five entries. And Carla, mm -hmm. you get five entries into the monthly appreciation so, giveaway box. What? So remember, in this replay giveaway, so anyone commenting on after this finishes and commenting on this, we're going to be giving extra tickets. So there's anyone that comments tickets, which will be anyone that hasn't maybe listened to now and comments. Mm -hmm. Then there will be anyone that comments with something a little bit more substantial about what Only we're you that are still about. here know this. I don't so point that through. We I'm could sorry. you can talk a time you can talk about something kind of specific, whether or not it's her new oh. glasses that she has something that we showed in one of First the time of the giveaways. Orange. The heart-shaped glasses she's wearing. The fact that I'm wearing a Gale the Snail It's Always Sunny that shirt looks that Mama like Drew thinks looks like me. Us Rusty talking about flight. Like, just talk about something specific that I'm bringing up. Like, yeah. something you see in the screen specifically. Yeah. That that's going to give you an extra ticket. Or right. an extra chance to get a and ticket. Because what we'll do is we'll we'll do like we do. We write everybody's names down. Yes. But if you and you'll be the in it, the first list will be everybody. So everybody. you'll have that chance. Everybody. The second list is going to be anybody that does what I was just explaining. Little something. Talk about the different. If you want to talk about different braces or ways you yeah had uh, helped heal injuries, like we talked about, bring that up. Something so we know that you listened this far along on our premiere and we appreciate. Yeah. To give you an us, and that that'll be, be a second, second list. So you could technically yeah. win both. Like that's yeah. Then that would be ten because you get five entries. So that'd be ten, and then we'll be, we're picking it that day. So yes. you'll find out about it and also have the potential of winning on the same live. Awesome. Um, did you have anything else, or would you like to show your my new grandson or ch grandchild? Or did I just throw you for a loopy? Yeah. She, uh, I talked to her today before I was coming over to make sure she was home and ready. I forgot I have it on. That window has more sun Okay, in that and right so she says, start. oh, yeah, when you come over, you get to meet your new grandchild. And I'm like, what? Not another animal. So this is my new grandchild. So it's still in the, I, I, the soil is getting ready. It has to dry out a little bit more. But I got a Venus flytrap. I've trap. never seen one in my life. And there, I it's already eaten life. here. There's one eating here. One, this one, unfortunately, he didn't catch. So that when they, so something you, if you want to know, I'm not going to go into too many facts about them, but um, they can only open and close their mouths so many times. 
So you can't, don't just touch it because if you touch it, it will close. Oh, really? Which is why I very want to very carefully try to get this out of here. I might even just like try to cut down the side. Maybe you cut from the bottom up and then just pull. Yeah. Yeah. Because if you touch them and they close too many times without getting the nutrients, they'll you slowly go. Them. Oh. But yeah, I saved two of them from, I didn't know from a store. Important. They weren't looking so well. And it was cute. One of my associates has a new apartment. And I was like, I'm going to save both of these. And I was like, oh, maybe I'll give her one. Like, she'll we probably like this. We've been rescue And then I was like, is this a weird gift to give? And when I watched the stuff, I was like, I was going to buy two of them anyway. But if you would like one, I wanted to give you one. And she loved it. So. Awesome. <laughs> Bailey and I now have a. Matching Venus we have fly twin, trap. twin baby friends. I didn't get one. Just saying. Most of, well, most of them were not. Most of them were not looking well. We've rescued a few plants uh, at the end of the season. We go and we buy up the plants that look like they're dead. I have two, four, or four beautiful, because there's two on either side, um, huge tree typey things, tall, skinny bushes or whatever you want to call them in my yard. But they, they were near <laughs> death. And they, we got them really cheap. But moreover, is they're going to throw them out. Let's try to at least give them some, you know, to sustain their life. I know it sounds weird, but. But yeah, so that's it. so anyway. So she said, I said, well, what do these things eat? Insects. She says insects. But they have to be small enough to fit in their in their mouth. Mouths. Now here's the conundrum: is I have two dog grandchildren and a cat grandchild that, and I have more, but that are in this house. Yeah. And the routine that I have here is when I come over, Polly gets her specific treats from Grandma. Careful with your words. Oh yeah. And then the DOGs get C O O K I E S S from the OMA. So that's a common <coughs> thing. So I said to her, I said, so now I'm going to have to start catching bugs. And as I was getting ready she did. to come over, there and was this little did. tiny bug <laughs> flying in my kitchen. And I just went and put it in a container. So I already brought a bug well, over. Already from, brought a I already brought a, a, a grandbaby. Is that for that? Yeah. 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 So I'll be doing that. Well, it's better than the snail she wanted to buy. I was a little bit... Yeah, I won't get into the reeds. I want to do snails, praying mantis. There's a lot nothing, of different insects. Naked snail, if you're here, nothing against you. I love I love There's a lot idea, of insects that I wanted to get, but there's certain parts of being a parent of those because of reproduction things and whatnot that I do not feel comfortable doing. So there you go. I, yeah. I'm just being a reasonable... If anything, I will maybe... Like, I saved a bunch of snails already in my yard. One of them I picked up, he was like, what's happening? I was like, you're really <laughs> far away from where you're going to be okay, buddy. Yeah. Like just, what's happening? So. <laughs> I could just see him. The little eyes just came out. Like, it was just instant. <laughs> yeah. Like, what the, who the heck, you're a monster. But, yeah, it's that funny. time of year because you're slowly moving things. Like, we haven't, we don't mow until. After the bunnies come fix the lawnmower. <laughs> well, also after the <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> But also, after all the critters are done yeah. with, they're ready to come out and it's warm enough. And bunnies, and that actually, it's spring info. Bunnies lay their, have their nests in grass. Mm -hmm. So please, when you're mowing your friggin' yard, be careful. Because you'll see, it'll be like a little hole. And there'll be a bunch of little babies in there. Please don't drive over that with your lawnmower, okay? Because the mommy would be very upset, and you'd and th their their yeah. home here is in, inundated with bunny rabbits. We have a lot of bunnies. And we used have a to lot of snakes. critters. Lots yeah, of yeah, and snakes. Craig wasn't happy about oh, that. Oh, there goes Bailey. So the snakes kind of disperse a little. There bit. were so many, like in the right in the front of the house, yeah. it was an overgrown, um, like garden stone bed. stone raised yeah. garden. And when we first moved here, it was, I mean, I would say saying there was like 27 to 35 snakes in there at any given time. At least. Is a valid. Understatement, in my opinion. Unless they're. Craig's not a big fan. I mean, I will say, like, it's intense when you're walking around the yard and, like, you take yeah. a step and it slithers away. It's scared. Just like, one, what are they called? Well, grouse? the one that was coiled up behind my bare feet when I was doing dishes and Hot Rod brought it in and dropped it right behind my feet. It coiled up. To this day, I don't know how I turned and walked over it, directly yeah. over it. And my that foot did not me. hit the top of this coiled snake. For the life of me, something beyond my control did that because... 
There's no way, because I walk with my feet very low to the ground because due to the all the little critters that I have in my house and, like, the baby kittens and all that kind of stuff. And um, I didn't step on it. And then when I got to the refrigerator and turned, and it was a brand new floor, like, the day or two before the man put a new floor down, and it it blended right into the all the colors of the brown and the matty wood, the floor. But I turned my head and saw this coiled snake that was directly behind my <laughs> My oh, bare no, feet. I just stepped over that. I just, I thought, I, I'm like, how did I do that? And then I did, I, I'm not afraid of snakes, but that whole incident creeped me out a little bit that I well, called the man. On one yeah, I told the man, I was like, it's it's a gardener, you want to bring it outside? And I don't, I, to be honest with you, I don't think he did. He said, well, I'm doing, uh, you know, because he gets nervous. And I think I did bring it outside, to be honest with you. I'm not 100% sure on that. I don't want to tell you the mis- mis- truth. But, There's been um, a lot of animal savings. But I do, I, the bats that fly in our house, uh, we've had um, probably three bats. Uh, the first one was before, when we were first building the house and reconstructing the house, remodeling, um, we didn't have, was it like electricity? Um, you know, not oh. a generator and stuff. And we had to walk uphill both ways to remodel the house. I don't want, yeah, and, and, and the bears would steal my, my lunch money. Um <laughs> But there was a bat flying around. We were laying down, just the light of the moon, and the bat swooshed down over us. And it, Freddy, uh, Freddy the Freeloader, one of our rescue cats, I was, I'm, he was jumping in the air. I'm like, what is he jumping? What's going on? And then <laughs> what is whoosh, he looking for? And he was trying to catch a bat. So I said to the man, I was like, oh, we got a bat in here. Bat in the house. And he immediately went under the covers. I kid you not. And I'm uh, excited. So I went and got my fishing. Uh, net that I use for the salmon and uh, got ready and I chased the little bat around until he got quiet and put the net and brought him out. He could have climbed through the net, but I he did. I let him outside, but I, I let out a also, Often three enough, of if them. you're calm and trying to save them oh, and they yeah. recognize that, they recognize that you're not trying to harm them and they're being saved. I know that with the hummingbirds and the dragonflies that fly in yeah. my house. I have one dragonfly. Not the idiot bird. I had get. I don't know if it's the same bird. It's always the same like it's probably the same bird, but I have a bird that gets stuck in my vestibule like four times every spring, because there's a, a doggy door, bird. and it comes yeah. through that, and it can't figure out how to get out, and it's just like long, like I, I get the the broom with something over it, so it's nice and soft, and just okay, just stay up, you're on it, just yeah, stay, just stay. Oh yeah. no, there you go again, yeah. <laughs> and it takes like an hour to get this thing out of the vestibule. How many animals did you get that go in your house? I've had four hummingbirds. Three bats, and a pear tree, and a, and a couple uh, a couple dragonflies. Now, one dragonfly, I, I got him, and I understand the, the hummingbirds being tired because they're flying around, and I wait for them to get exhausted and land, and then I pick them up, and I give them sugar water without red dye, sugar water to revive them because I know they just exhausted themselves. And then I bring them outside, and many of them have stayed in my hand. Um, but this dragonfly was flying around. I picked him up, and I went outside. He was on my. There's a video. There's a short in, in our shorts. You could see it, and he's on my thumb, and I'm like, okay, go. <laughs> and I, I said, well, let me get the camera. I walked back in the house, got the camera. I'm filming him, and he's flapping his wing, you know, stretching. It was really, it's a, it's a great video. Yeah. And then I'm like, okay, yeah, he was hanging out my house. I brought him outside, and then he just decided to fly away. I had one one of the hummingbirds stayed on my hand for over an hour. Oh yeah, I remember that. Oh one. man, I was like, "Come on, go, get out of here!" You know, <laughs> Good, yeah. my arm is. I got, I'm holding my arm with my other hand because my arm was hurting. But yeah, it's cool. I don't mind it. I, I don't want the bear in my house. No, I don't mind them in my backyard. Oh, the man came um, uh, told me the other day. Um, he's like, "We gotta stop feeding the deer." He he. He looked outside, there was literally like 10 deer right at my porch. <laughs> they were all waiting, like, when's she getting up and giving us some food? <laughs> Isn't this where we get this he, stuff? I know, and then I'm picking ticks off of uh, Oscar the tick, tick magnet because he they just love him. He's all black, long-haired cat, if you haven't seen him. And he gets ticks on him, so whenever he comes over in the house, even I put the tick guard, all of that, he sleeps with the, the deer. He loves the deer. Beautiful. And um, mm-hmm. he still gets ticks on them. And sometimes they'll be on his fur, and um, so they're not even affected. They don't bite him yet. But I have to, like, kind of 
feel over his fur to try to get him, and then they'll be walking on me. I don't want them. So they're speaking li- of they're lying critters for- waiting for food, um, some of you might have heard this, but it cracked me up. So for a decade and a half, if not more, we've been feeding crows at the shop that she oh, worked at and decade. I worked at. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's why I said a decade and a half or more. Oh, I thought you did. Okay, yeah. Um, <laughs> don't be <laughs> silly. <laughs> we all know this at this point. Uh, <laughs> So I feed the crows, and what they were learning is sometimes, like I was feeding them in the front, and then the seagulls were getting into it, two switched to the back, and then the seagulls were getting into it. So the, so the crows were actually like picking which side they wanted to like caw on, but the seagulls more often will go to the front. That's yeah. where closer, closer to McDonald's. Closer to McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> that was a very wonderful, <laughs> not obviously not planned. Um, and <laughs> one morning, I just, I'm working I'm like I'm at be I'm be in the back of the house so I can't see like the front door I'm just like organizing thing and the seagull is so loud and I'm like what is going on and it's we're not even officially opened yet it's like 9 45 we open at 10 we let people in whenever whoever gets there first lets if you come in what it's someone's their shop yeah. but I'm like what is happening right now and I look out and I walk to where I can see out the front and then in the very middle parking lot is this seagull just staring at the door that sometimes a human brings peanuts out oh. and just squawking as loud as it possibly can. Why I was like, is this, food? like, you're not a crow. Oh you my don't gosh. Get the peanuts. Next, <laughs> like, next, next like time he comes out, he's going to find something black that he could roll in <laughs> so he could change his color so he can come back and pretend he's but a crow. But that being said, the crow in the back caught a, few, a little bit later. And I went and talked to it for a little bit and flew up onto the line. If it's cl- too close, they these are new grandbabies. They fly away, but not too far. And I was like, oh, okay, I'm going to put some peanuts out. And I put the peanuts out. And as I was putting them out, he, like, looked, looked around. Okay, they look like they're safe and just flew away cawing. So he was letting everybody know, hey, guys. Peanuts. Peanut time happened. Come hey, get I learned, I learned some. I learned some new uh, updated uh, information about the crows that we'll maybe share with uh, uh, another informative video. I know we weren't very informative. We're more storytelling today, but um, yeah, the crows. Well, I figure we'll splice this with another video. Oh, we could do that. Maybe I'll even do all the information. We'll do like oh, a you mom could, game because I'm not. I didn't. You could even do that without Friday. me. That's true. You know, don't invite me. Or Friday. Just saying, <laughs> you would have not handled that tattoo convention I, at I, all. I'm just wagging, yeah. wagging on you. But, well, they, um, they fit a lot of boobs. I was trying to finish my sentence. Spot. Crows have the short. intelligence of a seven-year-old. Go ahead, Mary. That was it. That's all I wanted to share. <laughs> but yeah, so what we're thinking of doing, because it's a lot different when you're just trying to fill this amount of space with just us talking without actually knowing what's happening yeah, in the I know. feed there. Well, we're in the um, feed We'll be in the feed you. talking to you. Well, you already know that. Yeah, because we're there. in there and we're yeah. doing it. Um, but what I think we might do is try to get together on Friday, which has already happened for you and for us, but only us there, not us here. Um, we'll try to get together and maybe do another video so we can like splice the two together. So we yeah. have also, closer to a time. Also, if I can interject and, and throw this out here, we don't want to talk about the internet issues because, as you know, it's upsetting. But I would like your opinion. Are these premieres, what, you, what you're experiencing right now, is this something that if, if we do have an issue... And it, maybe we do these for a little bit until we can settle the whole internet problem. Is this something that you would still come and watch on our Saturday slot? Yeah. You know, if this is something that you would enjoy, we can make it more fun. And if, if there's something we could do to make it more fun that we won't get kicked off of YouTube with, let us know that as well. Yeah. Because um, this might be, you know, this week... So it was, mm-hmm. would you rather something like this or... W- are you preferring us trying to do it where we might pixelate and we'll just just everybody yeah. accepts that we're pixelated for the time and if we start to actually not be able to hear us anymore. So those are the two options we have going at the moment. And thank you all for the super chat, super stickers and gifted memberships. I I didn't say that earlier. I'm sorry. Thank you. We really do it really helps. But yeah, so if you much. want what would you would you like that kind of concept of it? Here's another thing. If you answer this question this is the second, so the first replay giveaway is every comment. This would qualify as answering this question would qualify as the second. So answer. Replay you might giveaway. be dropping stuff in here, but we're gonna tell you 
repeat that and go into the yeah, replay. Yeah, just put even if right, it's a little the, touch. The reason we're the reason we're doing thumbs, as you know, I know Tris brings it up all the time, and Samantha. Oh, by the way, Mantha's makes just hit two thousand. Congratulations! I just want I just saw that today when I was on my way here. Um, I love her. I was her very first subscriber, and make me. I, I just they're very special, uh, Samantha and uh, Mike. Um, no, I got so excited I forgot my thought. What were we talking about? You, I, I was talking about something and you interjected with a completely random thought, so I cannot help you get to where you were. I, we were talking about, well, I was talking about how we're going to be splicing another video into this and we got into a lot of other it was things. A, it was a good thought and I don't know where it went. It went somewhere. I have, you said thumbs and then you brought oh, up yeah, some people. Oh yeah, thumbs are important. Um, but replay comments and comments on videos, even if, like, like Tris says, even if it's an emoji, some kind of interaction, or if you share the com, if you share the video out on another platform of yours, if you, um, anything, you know, all of those things really help the content creator. And when we say these things, we say it for ourselves, but also for, for, for you to know for all the contents creators that you like, you know, that you know this. Also, to make sure, this is something we, we thought we saw when I was writing names down, because um, I had to click a certain thing to get the proper name. And there was a couple of wonderful people that commented on our replays that were not publicly subscribed. Now, we don't always check that. And okay? they still get, so... No matter what, if you're not subscribed, your ticket still goes in. So you still have that chance, but... In the bucket, yeah. In order to win the prize, you need to be a subscriber. Yes. So if anybody is listening right now and you don't understand what um, we're talking about, you're not sure how to subscribe, yes. if you have any questions at all, please reach out and we well, will there explain are, it to you. There are videos. I actually dropped a video probably a year and a half ago on how to check because a lot of people we can maybe even find don't that and even try to... realize that you have to go into that when you have a youtube you have you even though you don't have content you technically if you have a youtube uh handle you have a technically have a youtube channel you are automatically on the hi to all my subscribers you have to go in and fix that to make it publicly uh, public information of who you are subscribed to so people like us that have a channel when we look it says oh they're publicly subscribed so a lot of people don't know this that's why i don't freak out some people freak out like oh you're not publicly subscribed I mean, many people don't even realize they're not they don't even realize yeah. that what i'm telling you is a fact so there are i have a video i dropped how to do it um it's not difficult it takes a second you don't have to be a rocket scientist but there are other videos that you could look. Just Google how to become public subscribed. Yeah. There would be a myriad of videos to watch. It takes a few seconds. And then you understand that that's how you are. Because I, I've said this in the past because this happened and I, I'll repeat myself. There was a girl that um, didn't, you know, had uh, won something on my channel. This is going back two years or whatever. And I was like, oh, you're not publicly subscribed. And I explained to her, she goes, I don't know how to do this. So I explained to her how, no, I'm sorry, she didn't win anything from me, but she questioned about the public subscriber. I explained to her how to go about it. I emailed back and forth, and that's what triggered me to do the quick video. The next following day, she was entered in all these giveaways, and many content creators will just overlook you if you're not publicly subscribed. So if your name gets picked... You're, you're just tossed and the next one comes up. And she was picked on one of those channels that only considered public, public subscribers. And luckily she had fixed it with me the day prior. So she actually won. And she actually sent me like a little thank you thingy yeah, because that was nice because she, and she had no idea. So I don't, I, a lot of people that, are like, that's, oh, why, yeah. that's why we're explaining. Understand. That's why yeah. we're not, we're explaining that we understand not everybody recognizes about right. being subscribed or about being publicly subscribed. Yeah, you have so, to set yes, that. So, yes, let us know if you don't, if you need help with that. And yeah. we can 
explain stuff to you, help you get to the other video. I'll find yes. another video. But if and you the giveaways that we've had thus far, I really don't check. But yeah. but on a monthly subscriber video, you know, yeah, you know, I'd like you to be subscribed. Anywho, and so what we're probably going to do is um, fizzle out, fizzle Ooh, out of this yeah. one, but don't leave yet because we're going to come back yeah. with the next, which for us will be two days from now, for you will be now. Yes. I know. It'll be like a Boop. Because, because time is it isn't real. real. Our time is not real. Time is talking. not real. That isn't, doesn't work well oh, at all. Oh, well, should Sometimes you make the word not K-N-O-T? And really things. desecrate that whole sentence. Too many things. All right, because time, like the herb, like the herb but is that, but that, not yeah. real, like the like well, a movie. But those those the, the time and the real do because reflect we're taking us. away the word time and making it the spice and but that's part of our life. Yeah, and then we're talking about real Herbs, like movies and, and we things do movies, that we're doing kind here, of sort so of, it yeah works. Yeah. But yeah, so we're but going to... But the not would apply to... to uh, all right, we'll talk about I've already later. started things with time is not related. Never mind. The way no. I have it, so yeah. it's staying the way I'm it just is. thinking not would be crochet related. So, but that's right. We don't need all those misspelled... Mis we can make words. a joke thing about it. So okay. anyway, so yeah, so we're going to be cutting to another video. We're going to be opening guys. up again, but probably... Thanks again for lurking, for watching, for all your lovely comments, for all your... Which we don't have to go too much into, because as I'm describing... You're going to be halfway through the live right now, and we're going to be continuing on oh, so continue slicing those, those the next video after that, because if somebody <laughs> listened to me at all, like at all, during the lives... All right, <laughs> she's my kid. I spend what? a lifetime of her, ma, 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 that I just know how to block her out. And I'm just I'm trying to be like, hey, this is how we're going to have a smooth transition. So, anywho, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> and thank you. Like, so, yeah. I'll just put my chapstick on. Yeah, put on your chapstick. So, yeah, we are going to slowly transition into the second half of this Yeah, so stay tuned. Which we'll be filming on Friday, so you don't have this as yeah. much, because like we can only take so much before the yeah. spoons are gone. My, my spoons were gone this afternoon yeah, with yeah. that... <laughs> Dying disaster. Wait till that video comes out. Oh my god. I was so disappointed. So frustrated. It's a long video because it was it was long and trying on me. But yeah, but remember, I, remember I, the, remember I might have fixed it. I'm, I'm excited. So definitely check, keep an eye out for that one. Yeah. Remember the clues we told you about with the yes. replays. Yes. And I might give another clue in the second. Oh, so half stay tuned. This, there might be more which is stuff coming in the second third half. Third chance. <gasps> so it's that chance would be winning tickets in different times. Next week's appreciation giveaway and some random rusty giveaways, which I'm getting pretty close to getting ready to pick one. Ooh, mm -hmm. yes, random rusty. I got rewards. My you keep saying giveaways, but it's random I have rusty. To finish rewards. my skank of yarn before I can do that pull. Oh, Joe, I hope that's you're gonna here be because <laughs> she laughed so hard when I accidentally said skank. Oh, you said skank. I said it. it was yeah, me. she accidentally <laughs> said skank of yarn and then it just stuck and I kept saying skank of yarn. Yeah. So, Rolled with but it. But look, it developed into an actual art piece. Yeah. Excuse Anywho, me. Anywho, we'll see how well of a transition I can add between this and the next video. I'll just it do my It might just cut from this to, to us being in a whole nother thing, whole nother outfit, know. whole nother lighting, yeah. all that. All right, I'm going to so, let you press the button. I'm yeah. just going to do... We love you all, and we will see you in an actual millisecond. Yes. Oh. We're, we're still we're, here. Oh. Okay. Whew. <laughs> Been holding that for a whole day, twenty four <laughs> hours. <laughs> I was trying to get the camera as like close to exactly where we were last time. Yeah, and I forgot but to wear the, the same. Lighting outfit. is different. Yeah, well, we weren't yeah. planning on wearing the same outfit. No, yeah. lighting is different. All that, but um, <laughs> it just why not? We were trying to make that transition <laughs> really smooth, but no. And actually, we were talking about it. One one of the videos that we had done, um, the what the battery had died or something. Remember, we tried to do it, and we had we were no we um. Was this pre-laptop and your phone ran out of space? Yeah. Is that what happened? I think, yeah. yeah. I think it was pre-laptop, and we were filming in the kitchen when we do the angle with the black backdrop, and we were sitting, and we try to do the exact same position, but for whatever reason, I looked, and my brain saw Mama G and I looking like this. <laughs> 
But when what was actually happening was I was like this. Yeah. So when if you if you've seen it, you know what we're talking about. So so that smooth transition was another what happened. (laughs) Anyway, hello again, lovelies. Yes, hello everyone. Or thanks for staying that you're still here. (laughs) I know. Um. So to we talked about it, but I'm gonna tell you the other clue because remember there's a third chance, three chances this time. Yeah. To get. Entries into entries the monthly into the giveaway, monthly, which get. will be next week. Yeah. So you have the everybody's comment. You have the mentioning something specific about the video, whether or not it's complimenting a background thing, talking about something that like not just like cool content, like make sure it's something yeah, something specific, specific about something. We oh, s- I like yeah. how your shirt went yeah. from. The Gail the Snail Morton Salt shirt to wearing this black shirt, so I'll know it's a specific enough right. thing. And then the third one is going to be we never thought of a third word. We'll think of a yeah, third we, word. We have true. Oh, yeah, we have the did. emoji and then a word. I was going to think of another one, two word options, but that's fine. That one's two good. Two good, yeah. So right. a third ticket we will be pulling is if you use a tree leaf emoji, whether it be one of the different trees, palm tree, regular tree or a leaf, but something that's one of the emojis specific to trees and whatnot, or you talk about a road trip, because I'm currently on one right now, so you can be like, oh, I hope you have a good time time on your road trip, Rusty, and use the term road trip, but obviously, you know, sneak this one in good, because we, I want this to be like a good third, third poll, and we're, the tickets get, you're going to get the chance each time, so it's going to be, well, yeah, because what, what we always do for the replay giveaway is any re- any reply gets written down mm-hmm. and a, a number generated, random number gets picked. But then we're going to speci- take that, so everybody's going to be in that, regardless of what you put. Yeah. And then, then we're going to wean, wean that down to anybody who makes a comment specific and also, of course, has tree leaf emojis. Well, no, the second one is just specific. Oh, that's true. Well, so no, it's you would want to have that. your yeah. specific thing. Because that's specific that's true. to yeah, what so we're you saying. Can make it all one comment. Exactly. So it could be all in one comment. So that'd be something specific. So those people would that list would be smaller. Mm-hmm. And then now we're even smallering. So somebody that word. <laughs> list, it was listening before, but maybe is it here still? Right. Might make a long comment about a specific thing, but not use a tree emoji or say the word road trip. Right. They wouldn't that. They would only have the second yeah. chance. Now this is giving you a third chance now this, this with is even gonna, less people. Yeah, and you you could technically win or g- I mean, win someone the could technically all. win all three. Yeah, yeah by the same it's, person. It's, you get because of the it's right. The, Whoever is in the third is going to be in the second and first. You yeah. know, so yeah, so that that makes sense. And though, so there's going to be three uh, people that are going to each get each person will get five entries into the. Uh, a giveaway mm-hmm. and if we like what we're doing we might do this more often yeah and this is this is special because we really want to thank you for yeah this is a hard thank all you the craziness, for yeah. two lives back to back with all the pixelation and yeah of course it's green right now by the way the internet is oh of green. course it's perfectly green yeah we're still in the process of yeah, but, researching uh, and, and what yeah so this is a thank you for yeah. everybody you guys stayed yeah, through pixelation you stayed through Having to find another live, some of you might not have found the other second yeah. live. Um, what we are going to start doing is, if we're not going to do premieres and we're going to do a live, I'm going to set up a backup before we even go yeah. live, so everybody knows if this one doesn't work, that's our backup. And then if we don't need it, I'm sure just I can delete just it, I, either delete yeah. it or just edit it and make it next Saturday, so we can keep having a backup live until we use it, and then I'll make a new one. You can do that on your phone. Uh, if you do a laptop, I'd probably but do if it you're, on both. But if you're on a live on the laptop, are you also able to edit something? You follow what I'm saying? If we're doing the live, on I here, it would only have to be so. If we if we're if we're live and I have let's just say here is my, working it out while you're here. We're working yes, it together this is behind the scenes. You're, you're hanging out in the living room with us. Let's just say this is the backup live, and right. we're in this live right now. If nothing goes wrong on this live, right. I can just go. And make this backup live now for next week, Saturday. So it'll just go a week. You down. could do that. Because we didn't, yeah. Well, oh, we, okay. it wouldn't have to be while we were live. When the live is over, I didn't oh, need the backup live. Oh, I thought you would have that set for time. So Never I would mind. have to I, I, I put time, T-H-Y-M-E, in it. 
Yes. Time is not real. It's not and not would work. Yeah. It's just I already started the thing. I wonder yeah. if I can just edit the Discord page. To K N O T. I, I just think that n is not real. You're already, ma you know, we have the wrong, wrong, wrong time and the wrong real. And since we deal with knots in the Yarny I'll community. Say, if I can edit, because I, I mean, you don't why you could. editing I don't know. design I mean, and stuff is super easy. But if I can edit the Discord, that's technically the only yeah, thing. Yeah, and that is the Discord. If you want to join that, definitely do hop over there. And we do also have our uh, Facebook group. Just a reminder, if you didn't know, um, is uh what um malin moore Ma malin, malin moore mal and is it it's, i think it's an amber amber's amber's dog rubbing his butt on the carpet um mal and moore at with mama, with mama g. g yeah that's our face so you're doing emails at i know but yeah i got them all with at facebook yahoo gotcha. whatever because it's i can't remember if it's yahoo or gmail so I don't know if you noticed, but during that this live live in action, mail came. No, between our oh. filming the first half of this and filming the second half of this, yeah, I, I got, got a couple packages. Some it wasn't post office, so I uh, just want to quick yep, yep, yep. Linda. Uh, I got your your um, Linda sent me a little letter. Thank you. I did receive that. Um, Diane, I did email you. I did get that package. Thank you. And I haven't opened it. Opened it yet. And um, got a card from Michelle. She sent the thank you card. Thank you. I just wanted to say that. So I'm sorry. About that. So the first two are spiders. Look away if you don't want. Oh look yeah, at I'm looking at them and I'm a gr gorilla. I mean, they're little rubber boys. They're rubber things. Yeah, it's a little creepy. So I it's got this. very big. Uh, yeah. It's on my face. <laughs> <laughs> Alien. And you're only going to see one of each because these are going to go to Aaron. Mine are already strategically placed on my very large amount of earring holders. Definitely have and to I'm do another, another video. Of I'm already earrings. doubling up on some of these spots. Yeah. Yeah, I, mean, a lot I of have earrings. a lot of earrings. Yeah. Let me move it over so I can make it focus. So those are two spiders. Everything's yellow. So now these aren't spiders, so everybody can look. Um, yeah. I have to be careful because I go on super, like, hyper fixations and eat way too many but i love almonds yeah i've been eating them like so they're too. i don't know if it cover your face for a second let me see if it no then i'm wearing work. glasses so i assume that i kind of help on. but yeah so they're just little little almonds little blue diamond roasted mm -hmm. almonds i wish they had spicy dill pickle because those oh, are my favorite slamming. second favorite would be korean barbecue wasn't a fan of mexican street corn but also, I knew that Blue. one was a weird... Can There's I... blueberry. Wait a minute, wait. Can Mexican you... street corn almond. Street corn? Mexican street corn. The, like driving down a street mm -hmm. and corn... Like Mexican a... street corn is basically... Oh, like, vendors? Yeah, it's, that's oh. I think where the name for it okay. comes from. Yeah, but vendors. It's, yeah, okay. it's corn yeah. with like Parmesan and seasonings. It's basically oh, corn it done. Good. Yeah, it's, you would love it. Yeah. You are going to love it. You're going to Aaron love it. Aaron loves that because that's an It's Always Sunny reference. Oh, I don't know, but it's Always Sunny. This one I love. So then I got these little buddies. I'm just going to... This one's actually... Doing, He's so cute. Right. Oh, my and gosh. I, I wonder if... Jacob's, I can't Jacob's tell if this is... Lamb I think this Jacob's is food. the Shrinkies. Can we do that soon, though? I, yes. I have. I, yes. I, I have them. Oh my gosh, let's do Shrinkies. Yeah. We got them. Let's do them. Those are fun. We can draw our logos and things. That can be Mama G Gear Shrinky, Shrinky merch. We're going to do. look forward to a video. Remind us mm -hmm. that we need to do a video. There, there's your, your, your comment. Remind us to do the video of making our own Shrinkies, and we'll videotape it. Yeah. yeah. We're going to be videotaping uh, wet, felting, uh, yeah, wet felting soon because I'm getting the yarn out, and I, I can get into the closet now. Yes. I don't know if everything's going to fall out of it, but no, it's actually not as bad as I thought. I opened it the other day, and I was like, oh, I could actually reach all the fiber that's in my closet. And we are trying to train ourselves here in this household to keep the counter in the kitchen. We have a kitchen-like island. A little it's, island. It's right more right. of a peninsula because it's not... Yeah. So it's a peninsula because it's connected to a wall, but it Has comes three into, sides. Yeah, yeah. into the kitchen. Uh, that's going to be the station... Mm -hmm. uh, we have a another idea, but I'm not going to say anything because we want to make sure it can work beforehand. Yeah, yeah. Um, we have a few things that are up our sleeve. Yeah, ideas. But so that's going to be the station for 
what do felting. what felting and here. we might do some in my house too oh yeah no, we're, we're going to do it both i just wanted a new hobby that i can start working on right and there's parts of wet felting i think i will be more suited to the doing. heavy rolling and, the and then agitating even if i can do like bases and she's then a they great go agitator to, just saying <laughs> go ahead i had a, uh, it's had true a, it's true like, it, especially when i like i like to just who's that let's leave that right there who's that <laughs> Um, and I do it in a, I like to spark debate. I like for people yeah. to, God, there's people that have a Not very, maliciously, but just pointing to, yeah. yeah, in a nice way. I think it's very The only time aggressive. it's slightly malicious is when I'm doing, when I'm doing something specific because somebody is attacking somebody else's character. Yeah. Like if we're talking about a debate between certain type of like how to take care of a cat and next you thing you know, this person is belittling a person's yeah, personality, looks, it, or yeah. anything like that, then I'm going to do it maliciously because I have a cause. Intention. Yes. You're doing it intentionally. Bully, bully, bully for life. You're bully, intentionally bully life. putting them in their place. But I do like to stir the pot enough. Like, you guys know, I like to get yeah. people out of their comfort zone. Yeah. Try something new. You know, I, but look, what I was saying is, so I have somebody I met, there's a bunch of people, but there's somebody specifically here that is so opposite of thought process that I think with so many things, but knows that I will talk to them. I'm not going to immediately like, oh, I believe this thing. And I'm not going to bring up anything because I don't want to start conflict. Yeah. And, but it would, it would be something that would start conflict, something you're not supposed to talk about in the workplace. And he would ask me about it. Like I saw this article, I read this meme, I heard this and I would be like, okay, well I understand, but that yeah. Well, why don't you explain to me what you think that word means? And often he'd be like, yeah, like, I don't want to do that because it's this, 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 and this. And it's like, oh, well, you, you just described the thing you're against because media made you believe that this was something else. Right. So we can have those types of conversations. So I like to That's educating. drop little but things. Yeah, yeah. But most educated. of the time it's like, I'll drop something, I'll let it go. But then if it gets to a point, I'm going to be like, okay, well, now I'm going to step in because we can recognize that this while it is wildly talked about, is very inaccurate. I mean, yeah. shoot, there's still people that are taught that Christopher Columbus was a good old civilian. And discovered America. Yeah, no, that's he didn't, none yeah. of that. There's a, I think there's a lot, there's more, a lot, a lot more history that is taught incorrectly. And I mean, and there's I'm certain gonna, things. I'm going to include that there. So I, there's certain yeah. things that it's not that it's taught incorrectly, it's that what we knew about it then is different than what we know now. We found now. out more information. So that that's makes, different. Yeah, if yeah. a science book has different information two decades yeah. ago than it does now, that's because we've improved and learned stuff, so yeah. it's updated. Or if yeah. a, so, a sociolog psycholo psychology book is updated, that's because we've done more research with the brain and we understand something new about it, so we adapted yeah. to that. Yeah. But you can't adapt to history. <laughs> Um, it happened, and we don't teach an accurate one. So yeah, moving yeah, past no, it. We but don't. yes, yeah, we don't. A lot. No, of I do. It. I do like to. I like to stir pots for fun, and I like to stir. I like to open up the floor for educational debate. Yes, educational debate is a very healthy. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, I agree. 100%. Man, imagine if I like had the want to do after school programs, and I went into the debate team. Well, you, you, that's a, you did that. I just did it naturally with my teachers. Yeah, your teachers. That one teacher you had, was his name Pete? No, P Pete and I. Walter. Walter. Walter, uh, Walter. yeah. Um, oh, I think man. you disagreed with everything that man ever on said. On purpose. On purpose, and he, we he had, loved it. We would get into such heated, fueled debates. Not like what I do online when I'm just people are attacking character, but where the two of us, in, mind you, this would be during a class. There would be six yeah. other students. I went to a small co-op like alternate education program and so there'd be like six other kids in the class and it'd be we'd open up a topic for debate <laughs> and whatever and ever side he was on she'd go we would be going opposite, back and forth i think one of them was about tipping which is something i anybody we're in america here so tipping is different in some places some places don't need to tip here in america unfortunately yeah. some people are paid so poorly that they survive on the I hope on my service tip. has you give me tips because I need to feed my children. That's like a really common thing around here, and it's sad. Um, so I 
wholeheartedly support tipping. I'm somebody that bad service gets you a 15% tip. Unless yeah. you put, I, I joke about this all the time, unless you punch my mother, which I'm going to be like, hey, why did she have to punch her? Before I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm not giving you a tip. I'm going to ask I would why. hope that you'd see if I was okay first. Yeah, well, I'd make sure you were okay, but <laughs> like, why'd you have to punch my mom? Oh, she didn't have reason. Well, then I might not give you a tip. But no, no, you're not giving a tip. I, yeah. 15% is like my base tipping. Yeah. Then I'll go on and beyond that. So in this argument, we were talking about, I'm almost positive it was tipping that led to this. We were talking about tipping to the extent of I was saying, well, I don't care, you know, if they didn't want to, if they didn't want to have to, if they wanted to rely on my tips and they should have got a different job and like I so was, I was fighting the opposite. against it. Yeah. I, and, and very convincing at I one, say and everything. like we got to a point where he was just so fed up and I was like, <laughs> I believed in tipping the whole time. <laughs> so he we loved would, it. We would just have this teacher. It was great. Absolutely. Awesome. And if you say rest, All of those teachers rest are great. Soul, I had yeah, he wonderful loved the fact that you, you challenged him on a daily mm -hmm. ba basis. And I wouldn't be surprised that he actually thought of and picked topics that, that he would knew it, would yeah. bring that in because you also, it wasn't just you and him, but the, the whole class was involved because they were listening and citing yeah. and, and, and interjecting and, and, and getting involved. Part of it could have also been um, a spite feud because he never beat me at bocce. Oh. Yeah. So anyone that doesn't okay. know, so I know I've told this story before. So we would do gym every Thursday and we would play softball. And then I'm assuming one time Walter just noticed he had bocce balls in the back of his car or was like, oh, maybe we'll play bocce today. So he's like, anybody want to play bocce? And I'm We're like, We're an Italian in. family, so we had all bocce balls. In. I have at least two sets of yeah. bocce, if not more. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm all in. So I play, he plays, we're on opposite teams, other teammates also play, I win, or our team wins. Yeah. So then the following Thursday, he's like, all right, who wants to be on my team and who wants to be on his team? So he would pick, and then he'd pick who gets to be on whose team. I never got to pick my teammate. And we would just keep playing bocce, and I was really good at it. So yeah. I mean, I'm sure he won a time or two, but it became a thing. Lived. Like, yeah. Oh, 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 I just want to make a point. I, this is off the topic. I did not take my medicine my today. I did not take my medicine today, and that's the third or fourth time I've yawned. It has something to do with this whole thing. Just saying. Go ahead. Sorry. Well, sometimes yawning is a thing that's done as a correction in your brain. Yeah, it does it correct. So I'm wondering yeah. if there's something that happens with this. Will Maybe you have the way to I'm like sitting? I don't know. Yeah. No, I'm just yeah, interesting. Just, I I just always assume because I take a Klonopin before I come to the live, and I, I take Klonopin. Um before I come into a live, and that would be why I yawn, but I didn't today because we're videotaping, so it's it's a different comfort for me, even though we are right now live for you guys, but we are taping this, so it's a different thing. It's going to be really weird because we're going to be watching this in the past, but talking to people yeah. with it, about it in the present. It is. It's, it's, we are cracking time, yeah. kind of like I did with the last. I was so proud of myself for that lean-in with, like, now, what did Marie say? <laughs> oh, I know. Yeah. And that was like Love split it. second right before we were going on that she's playing. Most of the yeah. time, those little comical things that are planned are just a million. Yeah. There, there's times that we don't go on until like 4.06 because I'm like, okay, no, this is what we got to yeah. do. We're going to do this, all this, this one millisecond of time. This we have planned. And now let's yeah. do an hour and 50 minutes of unplanned except for my little like skit. Yeah. That's it. Otherwise, it's mm -hmm. yeah. I can't follow. It's yeah. Th there's a uh, another. Would you like a cup of coffee? Would you like a cup of coffee? Yeah. We need to tie. We need to tag. Yeah, that we, again that should be part of our. That should be, that should be our, our trailer. That should be our trailer. That's, that's yeah. what we were trying to make with yeah. our trailer. That we, we should just we make just, that our trailer. Yeah, because it's pretty much what we are. Just I really like a like like, like a cup of coffee. We just edit it to describe like we were yeah. trying to do a I commercial, and yeah. this is the best. We could. And and. There, there's a, a very sweet person that wants me to get my other channel going, and that channel would have to be more scripted, um, the mental health, mental wellness to wellness, and that would have to be more scripted because I'd have to be able to stay on topic and, and hit the bullet points. I mean, I, it's going to not be, I'm not going to be reading a script, but it would have to be outlined into, and everything is also have to, whatever. I and didn't I'm set thinking, up my little table. I don't know if I could do that. I don't know if I could actually... 
I couldn't you couldn't be an actor or an actress because you have to say exactly what they're telling you with the inflections and, and reactions and all that. Yeah, I'm very curious have to too. do and I I always thought I could do acting because of that. I forgot, never mind. I forgot we figured it out because oh. I was when we when we tried to do this trailer. I learned I have a whole show I'm working on. It's going to take a while, and yeah. I really hope it happens. And honestly, it would be if certain people yeah. can't do it, I might just have okay. Well, I'm gonna we're replacing people because I I want to make this happen. Yeah. Um, not in a mean way, just in a, no, if it's too you, much. You like if get it's it done, too much. You get it done. So originally we were like, if it's gonna be too much for you to try to act. But yeah. then I forgot that um, I know a paid voice actor that I'm sure would be willing to not be paid until we started making money. Yes. We um, probably never expect a penny so from what we do with the I forgot we were going to have you just move your mouth. Oh, that's right. And then we were going to have Dirk do that. the voice acting over your glasses. Oh, we really do have to do that. Actually, right now, you're hanging out yeah, with I'm, him. I'm probably... In real time. I'm, no, I'm, in, I'm probably still in route. I bank money. I'm so still in route. Weird. Hey, Rusty, <laughs> drop it in the I comments. Know. Are you driving still? Are you driving, Rusty? Are you yeah. driving? Are if you? not, please say hi to everybody there. And you were going to maybe see Bob, or you definitely going to see Bob. She's going to Pig Destroyer. And so give Bob, Bob also a huge oh. hug from me. You might be able to come to Fisher. Bob? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. So, you know Duck yeah. Hunter? You remember, remember Duck Hunter? Oh, Duck Hunter. The old school game. I and thought it was just Duck Hunt. Duck Hunt? Was it Duck Hunt? Yeah. Okay, Duck Hunt, that old school game, and you would have a, like, yellow toy. Yeah. I was good at that. And if you didn't win, the dog would laugh at you yes. with the ducks. I saw something, somebody paint that on a fence, and I was like, oh, my goodness. Oh. The back of one of my barns, which, if I had money, I'd probably just tear it down, but I also love old buildings, so yeah, I don't mind it, like, slowly just doing its thing. But from the road, you can see it. And it's gross on that side. So I've always wanted to paint something there, but I was, I was like, I don't know. I was like, at one point it was going to be, actually at one point it was going to be a scientist dinosaur, but then instead we got those tattooed. So yeah, um, I remember you about the dinosaur. So, but then I saw that and I was like, that would be perfect because there's a pond, there's yes. field, there's thicket, and then it would just be the, the giant dog. So uh, You know what's hysterical is you know where I used to play Duck Hunt? Yeah. At Irv. Oh, really? I used yeah. to play it over Irv's and Sue's house, my neighbors. When I came up here, that's we used to get together and play cards, and sometimes we'd play duck hunt until nice. I beat him, and then he stopped playing it with me. Yeah, because he's a hunter, and I beat him. It's just a game. I mean, See, if there's d a difference between that and then me fully understanding Craig, like, being a little more hesitant to play games with I would play games every night if I could. I love games. Um, yeah. Which we should probably we should start. Really, we, we really, really should, should start a game night. Yeah. I want to start a movie night in the hangar and we can have movie oh, night yeah. with game nights because we can play games and movie in the back. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but I'm really good at games because I that's what I do. I play puzzles. I mean, I showed you guys my wooden puzzle that yeah. I started looking at and I think I have a good idea, but I'm wait. I'm going to so give myself well, a little more time. Well, even those things you build. Yeah, build them 3D puzzles. puzzles. Yeah, that's... I, I love that stuff. So I'm yeah. really good at breaking down games. One, I'm not... I still have a few games in there that are such big games that I need someone to help me learn how to play. Once I figure that out, I'll slowly break down how to win. And you play D and D. Maybe some of you guys play it or know about it. That's yeah. That's, that's more like that's just action. That's more big, uh, real people. Yeah, that's more just like role play, playing, role fun, playing. Yeah, role playing with. Which dice. remind me, um, oh my gosh, um, what's it called? Humble, humble. Um, Nessa from Infinitely Zero, um, she she let us know about it, it, you can get books cheap, and I had gotten a bunch of patterns I bought. They have one that's all like forty one books now. They're offering us all to make cosplay stuff. Oh, cool! And I wanted to show you, and I forgot about it. So well, actually, we'll we'll know. Hey, I'm reminding. Mama G, have you told Rusty that yeah. yet? Rusty Mama that's G, in have the you car. reminded Rusty? About I know it's Humble? just so weird. I'm, but it's then, so perfect that we finally came up with our name being Time Isn't Real for, like, the big umbrella. Yeah, that's the production. what that's we're going to do is yeah. start a Patreon. The Patreon will include this, this but channel. it's going to be Time Isn't Real. Time is not real. Is not real yeah. because uh, it's going to include more. So yeah. we'll have tiers that'll be your basic and then hopefully moving forward. Because one... The skit show that I plan on making, we can't just make. 
that's going to be a point of that's production. I've been I've been saving my personal money aside. I mean, I have a couch at the corner park that I need to get. I'm putting money into this, but I'm I'm doing both. But um, yeah. So I'm literally been putting money aside. That's going to be a lot. So when we do finally make that, that's definitely going to be something that we offer to a tier of our channel that will get it. So it's how a lot of people do it on Patreon, where you'll have everybody can join your Patreon and you can get the monthly schedule of the things that are available depending on your tier. You can get the links to our basic mm. videos, the links to our lives, and then tier two, you'll get a little bit extra. You might get, I might start writing stories again, so you might get a little bit of rusty story time. Yeah. So that's where we're working towards. It's I just, ain't doing anything. I have to do a little bit of more. Yeah. I'm going to start it and just have it be a basic thing. Getting tears and, and stuff is going to probably take a little bit. As you're working to it, yeah. Because yeah. that's a, I, I am a patron of a couple, um, peop, a couple of content uh, people. And one is a musician, and um, the other one is, uh, he does an incredible amount of uh, research into, uh, into what he delivers. John Solo, I'll, 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 why am I not saying your name? John Solo, it's J-O-N Solo. And he always ends with Solo, what, what's that, uh, Star, Star Trek, or Star Wars? I remember Solo, John, Solo shot first or something. He, whatever, he ends it with something that has to do with, I, I mentioned it, and, and Craig had known that it was Oh, yeah, Craig Solo. knows, I don't know. Yeah. But uh, his name is I'm John Solo, J-O-N-S-O-L-O. He is hysterical, but he gives you really, the messed up origins about, like, stuff that, you know, you have. And I do follow him. I, I'm a, I pay his Patreon. And then, of course, Corvix. I pay his mm -hmm. Patreon because he's an amazing, amazing uh so yeah, so we're going to do a basic singer. Patreon, and then we'll work from there. Yeah. I do want to um, go on that. I, I said, because you said about Star Wars, and I said, I'm a dork, not a nerd. I want to stand oh, by the fact that okay, a dork, yeah. a nerd, and a geek are three different things. Yeah. So Fine. I'm a dork. I can talk to you about weird space facts, or things like manatees, many things, when I see that I can't stop talking about farting. Uh, <laughs> That's got to be a t-shirt. Yeah. Definitely or, merch. I, like, space things, science... I like to put Brain. together, I'm, I'm borderline on geek because I like to put together little robotic things and whatnot, oh. whereas going into geek, now you're building robots, I can fight with other robots, or like that robot. That's computer fixing yeah, like stuff. Yeah, computer yep. fixing stuff is going into geek, and then when that computer fixer person starts to also have all the comic book series of something that he can tell you super, but now, you've, now you're borderline into nerd, and then when that nerd that is super into the comic books and knows all about Star Wars is starting to tell you about the space facts he knows you're getting back into dork. So that's kind of oh. like, we're all a swimming pool. So I don't follow fall in any of those. No, because you're not a dork, geek, or a nerd. No. I'm just a jerk. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's one of those. Jerk. <laughs> I, I love that one because I've had people hard debate me on it, which is funny because it's like, you don't have to get upset. This is just my fault. Well, it's process. your opinion. But, um, it's your inter more interpretation people of the word. back but, me on that than they don't. Yeah, well, the Geek Squad, that makes sense because that, that, they use that term. Mm -hmm. And I, re I remember, I mean, I'm going back in the 60s and se early 70s, but in school, um, nerds were just really education. They were very educated book learners. Well, now nerd is the person. Well, so a nerd would be a little bit back in the day, or like in my back in the day, would be the person playing D&D &D and going to cosplay. And it's really cool for younger kids now that it's so much more acceptable. Yeah. Now it's like, oh, cool, look at your awesome cosplay where back in the day you were a nerd. Not gotcha. a dork yeah. because a dork would be in a science class. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah and that makes sense. No, it, it, so well, I, the evolution of uh, the English language. It is language. a hill that I will sit confirmly on. Yeah. Because that's what I'll be I rolling down that hill. Well, there's that, old, there's that hill that I would on. It is a saying. Yeah. So now mine is that hill that I will con sit firmly on. Yep. And that is. That is a hill that I will sit on. And I'll stand on my soapbox. Mm -hmm. Only because I'm short and I can't reach the top shelf. But go ahead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're really hoping that this uploads after all of this. I know. Don't um, even say that here. Cause, yeah. So cause everybody, if, 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 if you don't see this, you're, you're not seeing we're this. We're both. In, and I know you don't know this. So yeah. I'm going to mentally send this to all of you. He's sending us good vibes that this uploads. Really want yeah. to see this so you can see this, but you won't know until then. Yeah. Until no, I'm sure a couple of you are getting like a little like, hmm, I hope Mama G's live goes well tomorrow. 
Yes, I hope so. I know we do have some people that are, are actually saying that because they've said it to me personally. Yeah, come back because it's it's time. yeah, and 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 if we have to do, uh, you know, a couple premieres before we get everything set up and settled to be able to do the lives again, you yeah. know, we're that's gonna what figure we'll it do. out. We'll, you you guys have stuck with us, and and again, thank you so much for all of that because it means the world. Yeah, and I think that there. next week, obviously, we're gonna to try it. to go live. Um, and because, we'll have that back up, like you said. Yeah, we'll go, try to go live. We'll have that back up. And Can we have, have a backup premiere? Right? Can we do a backup premiere? We could do a backup premiere, but... I mean, I guess we could do a backup premiere, but it would because we're going to be pulling the tickets... On we'll my phone. I think I can... If, if, it's, if it's uploaded as a premiere on my phone... We might do that because we could upload the premiere for a, like a later time and I can go on my phone into YouTube studio and go on to that particular video because it could be uploaded and hit edit and, and stop it from going live. Yes, because in this instance, it would have to happen when it was live. So yeah. Yeah. So we could do that. So maybe that, that but, might but be. But again, though, we wouldn't know the time it would need to go. Well, if we if we figure usually it's within fifteen minutes, twenty minutes, or whatever. If we still agree, if we sit, well, that's because we're not live. I know it's because we're yeah, not sucking so anything. It's it, it's, yeah. it's really I ch certain times so a day. I I would like to try some random. We're gonna try random pop up lives that are yeah. very much going to probably be like, hey, we're not gonna be able to be on for long because she just, just stopped over because yeah. I was given a random food I had in my fridge. Yes. So we only have a short period of oh, time here. Oh, by the here. way, I ate some of the cheese last night right. with onions. So I woke up just all night I could smell I, onions. In my dream, I still had that cheese, which was just a weird little, oh, like... I was enjoying it. That's it's just a weird... Yeah, it might, I was sending it. I was like, oh, this is so Craig good. put it on the something we were eating in part of my dream. I have oh. weird spots of my dreams that are normal, and they stumble back into, like, hell. Craziness, Yeah. I was sending you the yummy vibes because I was enjoying the cheese. Now I'm. Just I was also really it. good at roller skating in my dream the other night. Well, that's because you fell when you were feeling. To better. the point of, uh, not really. <laughs> to the point of, uh, I'm curious thinking. when I start going how much of that was actual. I was like practicing with one of my feet up, going on full on two wheels from side to side. I couldn't learn this now. I'd need nice. better skates by then. Yeah. I I got. Not super cheap skates, but yeah. inexpensive skates, so they're flimsier on the sides. So I'm going to be able to learn all those like flat tricks. You need triple triple leather boots. Yeah, but yeah. once once yeah. I want to actually Indie start riders. going on edges, I need something Indie where I, I don't yeah. roll and break my ankle. You're looking to spend a few hundred dollars on a good pair of boots. Yeah, you know, and then you have the the but pick the wheel, pick the boots. You know, if you're going to do it and you're going to do, you've been talking about it and been wanting to do this for and a long been time. practicing. So there's a great birthday present combo Christmas present and get if you're going to do this you need good yeah good leather that no, you I've wear and they into mold them. to your feet yeah. you know like you did with your ice skates when you were a kid you know you got the good ones because it's you don't play games with your ankles no so that's why right now I'll play little I'm learning little things but I'm not going to get too far till yeah uh, and I just want to are, are we almost done with because we were what um, I'm just thinking because we I were, feel because we did an hour so we're about an yeah. hour and a half so All there's right. going to be a, a gap obviously um, so you're gonna go at from some here point to drop D's. Yeah, D's. Or I guess we could probably drop D's because we're in the comments. Yeah, um, D's going, of course, live after us, but D is doing her celebration. I may still be in the comments. I may be not listening because uh, when I get to their house, I'm not I gonna... might be away. I love you all, but when I get, I don't like, wouldn't want to be rude when I go visit somebody I haven't seen oh, in a while. Yeah. I'm not going to go and be like, oh, sorry, just scared my wife yeah, a little no, bit. Uh, so, a lot of times yeah. you guys are chatting with each other anyway, so it's just a, it's just a meeting place. So if know? I'm not still here in the comments, I'm here in the video and still. Yes. But uh, yeah, and then tonight, of course, I don't need to tell you, but Bod's doing her auction right after D. So we got a fun filled. We I thought we had something else. Oh, and just a reminder I know I said it before, I'm going to say it again, and hopefully D will mention it in hers. As last week in D's live, I said that our, our auction, the Mental Health and Meow Animal auction, is the, the 18th of May, Saturday, the 18th of May. Not the 11th, because the 11th was in my mind, because we're hopefully that weekend going to be going uh, to hang out with my de very dear friend, her aunt, um, you know, one of my oldest friends. So we might be there. And if we do do that, we will have another premiere on the 11th because we'll be away. Mm -hmm. And I haven't been away on a weekend and I don't remember when. Yeah. 
I think Tony, going to Tony, who's the last time I've been away for a weekend, and now he's been here a year and a half, two years. I don't know, time. Time is not real. Time is not real. Yeah, we got to change it to K-N-O-T, right? Thumbs up on the K-N-O-T. Yes. Anyway, I think we're set. Oh, were we going to talk about what I told you? I have this oh, little. yeah, so. Um, there's like a little red spot right here. Have you ever had an issue when you're at your house and we'll end on this your one. skin is dry and you're like, oh, let me use this. So she just straight up uses chapstick. Chapstick. Doesn't chapstick like putting chapstick over here, is putting chapstick my... over here. Oh, I got knuckles, putting chaps. Like, don't get me wrong. If I'm out and I don't have anything but chapstick and my hands are super ashy, I sometimes put a little chapstick on my knuckles and rub them together. Yeah. But it's like... I, I actually bypass the moisturizer. She has in my multiple knife. good moisturizers. Now, these are mine. Um, but no, I have expensive moisturizers. moisturizers <laughs> you could be using on parts of your face <laughs> and whatnot. Not like medicated fucking chapstick. I swear. Which is probably why your I skin gets so dry in those you, spots. I swear to you that this is what I do. I swear. I'm laying in bed at night and I'm like, ah, you know, I didn't, I didn't put moisturizer on because I often forget. You know, I wash my face. My face is wet so I don't put the moisturizer on. It's wet. There's like, probably some people that I'm have good skincare in, right now and they're cringing. You are guys are cringing, right? So I'm laying in bed. Chapstick. And I've got my chapstick and I'll do this and then I'll go, oh, let me just put some on my forehead and rub it in. And I'll yeah, like you need to put uh, just oh, real and that's lotion. How I, that's how I moisturize my face, yeah. No, I'm, you guys are all like, like putting oily out wax right on your skin. Yeah, no, I am. And then I'm wondering why, why am I breaking out over here? Because my skin. Oh, I wonder. I stopped breathing because I covered it with chaps. Dipping face in oil. Why am I breaking out so much? It's really crazy. <laughs> and I know it and I still do it. I don't know. And, and there's moisturizer. I have nice, good, expensive moisturizer on my, on my night. Maybe you need to start putting two moisturizer on your thing. lips. And see, just go full Maybe moisturizer. Maybe that's it. I need a good tasting just moisturizer. Get rid of the chapstick you know, and just yeah. switch to moisturizer. If you know of a good tasting moisturizer, let me, moisturizer, mm -hmm. as I would say. But uh, yeah, let me know because I might do that. Just to have that and then use moisturizer on my lips. But yeah, mm -hmm. I, put, I use chapstick as moisturizer. Yeah. And you can write that in the comment. Yeah. <laughs> Here, that'll be another thing. Yeah. You can either, so for the people that know, you already know, free options. Yeah. So it can be, a, it can be any of I'll these. One, either a tree leaf emoji, using the word road trip, stealth mode in a sentence, or talking about Mama G's moisturizer. Chapstick, yeah. Whether or not it's giving her advice on moisturizers, yeah. or um, you're shaking the table pretty good. I'm there. sorry, I shook um, you around. Apologize. <laughs> giving you advice on it, asking her why chapstick. Um, so those are you can do any of those things, and that's going to yeah. give you the third poll for tickets. And that's and that's going to be one a very small one. Include yeah. tickets in bulk. Oh, okay. Let me yeah. write that I'm down. I'm doing a random rusty ticket. All right. A random rusty the, reward. So this third, the third one you just mentioned. You're going to get a random rusty reward. I've just been doing RRR. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, I know what that is. And then a, and then a uh, entry. Okay. I just do two R's, but yeah. All right. That's random rusty rewards. Yeah, but you do two R's. RR. It, That's yeah. railroad. That's fine. Then it makes me think of uh, like like the game Monopoly. I wish we had better railroad systems here. Yeah, we need... Oh, I know. Europe has great ones. Anyway, we're, we're dragging this out. Yeah, we love you all. And, uh, yeah. Thank yeah, you for absolutely. being part of our community. I know. And you know, let us know also too if these are if these work out all right then we might have to do a few more for a little bit and then even down the road we can do some and maybe just be there hanging out with you in there. Cuz I like this. Yeah. Because if if something were to happen whatever I could just hit pause. I feel I, I I'm noticing that I'm maybe it's just today. I don't know how I was yesterday, but I feel like I'm more relaxed. Cuz to me this is more of a video. Maybe, but if you rewatch, I think and that I'm, there's no comment for me to be watching. Yeah, right now. that's. I think part that's part of it is that yeah, you need no to comments. recognize that one specific comments need to be answered by you. Somebody's going to let you know, or it's going yeah. to be rewritten with caps. That's why I'm less. Yeah, I'm more. Focused. I think it's less about the being alive, and it's literally just your focus. It's fixation the John on comments. comments. Well, we just learned something new. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's it. That's what it is. It's because I I got calmer. When you guys told me stop writing everything down, and then Zoila and Aaron were doing that, and now I'm, I feel like this is more like I'm hanging with you guys, but it's more like I do when I'm doing a video where yeah. I don't look at it as a camera, I look at it as if I'm talking to you. So that's how I'm feeling now, and I'm not preoccupied or trying to read the, I am at home, but yeah. I'm not now. 
So I think that's part of it. Yeah, so definitely. Maybe we will do maybe one premiere a month, you know, whatever. But we'll, we'll talk about that. We'll figure it out. All right, we'll figure it out. You got to enjoy a lot of the behind the scenes because we did a lot of yeah, the this is what we, yeah. you know, housekeeping stuff. Mm-hmm. But, uh, yeah, we love you all. Just hang in. Thank you so much. And thank you for any super chats, yes. super stickers, all that stuff that you but have thank done. you so much for staying with us and, through yeah. the the rough roads. Yeah. We appreciate it. We do. But, uh, yeah. We know you love us. We love you, Come too. back, make your comments. And you're in charge of doing the shut off. I'm curious. Let's well, want to guess. Let's see. I'm not, let's not guess. I don't want to shortchange ourselves. Hopefully, we've made it to 100 subs. Oh, that would be nice. That would be, nice. That would be super nice. So, we love you all.